A sex crazed monster in a learning module horrifies lawmakers on Monday, June 14, as they investigated errors in billions of pesos worth of student readings. The aswang is often depicted as a winged monster in Filipino folklore, but a learning module on Philippine literature erroneously described it as a creature looking for sex at night. The module was used in February by grade 10 students aged around 15 years old in the public schools of Abalacat, Pampanga. It is one of the materials produced using the 15 billion peso budget for learning modules as the Philippines implements distance learning during the COVID-19 pandemic. Part of the learning module read, The Aswang is a god but it's believed to be a human being that eats other human beings. Many believe they have wings that are awake at night to find someone to have sex with or devour. Antonio Calipogo, a teacher known for pushing for error-free textbooks, presents this learning material in a house panel hearing on Monday. Education Undersecretary Justado San Antonio says the mistakes were part of the error submitted to them. He adds the division office in Pampanga has already acted on it and the module was recalled. Agusan del Norte 1st District Representative Lawrence Fortun asks why the mistake was able to pass through DepEd's vetting process. Napaka glaring po nung error, hindi lang siya hindi lang siya error na ano eh, nagkamay ng spelling po, may issue sa editorial preference. Napakalayo ng ano, ng definition. At bakit ganun yung language? At uh, yung language na pumasok, eh wala namang karelasyon doon sa definition na na gustong ibigay. In response, Education Undersecretary Tony Sito Umali says while DepEd has vetting procedures for publishing learning modules, some mistakes are still committed. In the 2021 national budget, the government allocated a total of 15 billion pesos for the printing of learning modules.